gonna do tonight, right? Same thing we do every night, Chris. Try to take over Comic-Con, and then the world! <laughs> What's happening my fellow geeks and geekettes? Welcome to a brand new, very special episode of Cosplay Chris. I want to introduce you to two very special individuals. Woo! I got Jennifer and I got Mike. Guys, say hello. Hi! Hello. Mike is commandeering this ship. We are driving from Los Angeles to San Diego. It's going to be about three and a bit hour drive. Just got some traffic on the way. So we are headed to San Diego. Comic Con, one of the biggest comic book conventions in the world. This is pretty much the convention that started it all. Um, so over the next three days, Jen and I will be at the autograph area. I think it's AA22. So tomorrow we start at 10 a.m. Uh, till 2.30. The same for Saturday and Sunday, 10 a.m. to 1.30. So I'm gonna try and vlog as much as possible because when I finish up at 2.30 uh, uh, tomorrow and on the Saturday and 1.30 on the Sunday, I'm just gonna be roaming around the floor. I wanna meet people. I wanna meet people in their amazing cosplays, pick their brains, talk shop. Um, you know, we've got the Aquaman stuff on display. We've also got the Shazam costume on display. So I wanna try and get as much footage for you guys. So I'm gonna be switching back and forth between either my phone, which I'm using now, or the ADD. So most stuff on the con floor will be the ADD because it's HD. Get up nice and close with those beautiful costumes and those beautiful cosplays. So yeah, the banter is strong in the car at the moment, so that's it, you know, next time uh, this vlog picks up, we're gonna be in San Diego. San Diego! So we are here in San Diego. It is day one for us of San Diego Comic Con. Uh, even though it officially started yesterday, the day before that, it was kind of like the preview afternoon slash night. I've got to show you guys this. Look how beautiful this view is. San Diego is such a beautiful city. And like you, this, this is one thing, and then the city itself is just absolutely amazing. So. All just got up, um, I'm about to start getting ready. Got to head in a little bit earlier because I actually have a television interview with the Channel 9 correspondent from Australia who is based here in the United States, which is amazing. Then after that, we're gonna head to our autograph booths and yeah, um, it's, it's, I have no idea what type of footage I'm about to get. So, <laughs> look. It's going to be a cracker. It's going to be a good one. Um, after I'm done at the autograph booth for today, you know, tomorrow and the next day, I'm going to try and get as much footage as possible on the floor, whether it be, you know, costumes and cosplays and just people in general. This is what it's all about. It's meeting new people and just having a good time and a brand new experience. So a very last minute change of plans. I was doing casual Chris today, but today it's Drake. Uh, got a little telly interview. Jen, how you feeling? Hi, I'm so good. Mike, how you feeling? Hello, awesome. <laughs> Hello. We're, we're professionals. Well, we're I... in the profession. Look, there are no people around. We're actually walking around San Diego Comic Con. Look, there's Conan on a building. And we don't have to push people out of the way. <laughs> we're special. <laughs> Okay, so just had a pretty awesome interview with uh, Channel 9 correspondent Charles Croucher. He was awesome, so that's actually going to be uh, airing this Sunday uh, Australian time or Sydney time uh, on the 6 o'clock news, so that was amazing. So we are all set up in the autograph area as Jen's setting up. Got some prints there, ready to go. Ready to meet some awesome fans. And then when we clock off at 2.30, we're gonna hit the floor and we're gonna try and get some footage of all the amazing stuff here. Guys, this is Robert. Robert, say hello to everybody. Hi, everyone. Robert is a local in San Diego here. This is your fourth year. This is my fourth year, yeah. What has been the best year so far for you? Right? This 
Really? This <laughs> right here is the best right now. So I just signed Rob's Imposter Batman pop vinyl. I've never signed a pop vinyl before, so this is a first for me. So this is history right here. Yeah. So I just thought I'd use the restroom and I've jumped again. <laughs> so anyway, I went to use the restroom and I bumped into the lovely Johnny B, this beautiful inked man. Look at this. So this is Johnny's uh, logo here and we've got his Instagram here, Johnny B underscore tattoo. Dude, are you from San Diego? Reno, Nevada. Reno, Nevada. Yeah. Beautiful. So you came all the way. You did. Dude. Wife and daughter are at the hotel and I'm sitting here nerding out and having fun. Oh god, what a good family, man. <laughs> right, exactly. Um, is this your first Comic Con? First San Diego one. How do you... Everything else, I've been to all the smaller ones, but this one is overwhelming. You've it never is. been here before, you will never see everything, and it's awesome. I've never seen a crowd like this. It's incredible. Incredible. But I think, like, because usually I'm put off by crowds, mm -hmm. but I think the crowds help make it. Oh, yeah. It, like, it really hypes does. everything like, up. The cosplay stuff from the vendors, everything yeah. is just amazing. Like, it's Dude. totally worth it in every way. Dude, that's awesome. Johnny actually did a Hulkbuster custom yeah. collectible. So that's awesome, because that was your first. That was my that first, was my yeah. first. So. Exactly. Yours might have been a little bit better, but it still was, uh, I think, just equally as fun. So. Still still figuring stuff out, man. I still yes, am. I think exactly. we all are. Uh, <laughs> Dude, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Appreciate man. It. It's nice meeting you. Have a good day. I found my brother. Except he looks like 20 times better. <laughs> and then these ladies look amazing. Absolutely amazing. So I'm here with David. David, say hello. Hey guys. David is from Australia. You're from Geelong, man. Yeah. I was in Geelong about a month and a half ago. So this is your first Comic Con. Yes. This is my second Comic Con, but you know, proper experience. I'm gonna count this as my first. Yeah. How are you finding it so far? Crazy. It's awesome. So many cosplayers and just all the everything. The it's, crowd's mental, it's man. Great. Um, and you are dressed as a lovely Peter Quill, Star-Lord. Very nice. Where'd you get your helmet from? Uh, I got it from Excosa. It was like a, um, it came as raw, like, yep. uh, unpainted and spent, uh, I had to, I stuffed up, so I had to start again. And I'm happy with like, how it turned out. It looks out. beautiful, yeah. man. The weathering is, it's got a nice finish on it too. Yeah. Fantastic, man. Hi, this is David with DDT Cosplay. Brittany with DDT Cosplay. Now, guys, like, these two complement each other absolutely perfectly. But, Look at the craftsmanship in this. So this is EVA foam. Uh, David, you said uh, here for the under part is five millimeter. Five millimeter. And then lay it up. Lay it up, yeah. Fantastic. And the belt here is? It's five millimeter as well. And then oops, the yeah. pockets actually open up. And it's magnetic. Yeah, the door hinges on the back. Door hinges? Little, hin or little hinges on the back. Wow. Not door hinges. Now, if you're wondering why the claws are gone there, um, it's so, all right, do you want to do a pose? Yes, there we go. So signing is done for the day. It's after 2.30 and I'm actually on the IMDB boat. Kevin Smith is just upstairs doing interviews. This is crazy. This is, I don't know what to say. Like, look at all this. This is amazing. This is, this is, this is bedlam. So that's pretty much it for today. Um, got all that footage on the con floor. Got to go on the IMDB boat. Um, we're probably gonna go on there again tomorrow. So today's pretty much a wrap 
for Friday at um, San Diego Comic Con. Um, I'm just waiting on Jen and Mike now. They're just trying out some VR stuff. And then we're gonna go downtown, just down there, and go grab something to eat, get a much needed rewarding beer. Um, this town is packed full of geeks and geekettes. It is phenomenally crazy. Like the whole town gets in on it. I've never seen anything like this. So today is day two. It's Saturday, it's sunny, it's lovely, it's hot, and we're just about to head inside and set up. Uh, 10 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. today, just like yesterday. Um, then after that, we're gonna get up to some shenanigans, walk along the floor, um, yeah. Hey. Guys, so guys, I'm here with Carmon, that's hey. correct? Yes. So Carmon has said if I could sign his Kylo Ren lightsaber hilt that he has customized, like yeah. one of my very early, I forget which one that it was. was like, like less than 100k subs, I think. Yeah, yeah man, it was is. like not long after the uh, Hulkbuster. It was, I think it might be right after the Hulkbuster. This might be your second custom collector, right? Hulkbuster right. was first, right? Hulkbuster was first. And then it was Kylo because it was Force Awakens that was coming out. You did a bunch. Yeah, man. I'm I love it. I'm thinking okay. maybe somewhere along the grip here, <laughs> we'll figure it out. So just behind me there is Mr. Phil Lamar the voice of Hermes from Futurama and Ollie from Family Guy. This is so cool. I want to go up to him and do my Zoyberg impression. Wonderful. Oh, stop it, you filthy crap. Now, I'm going to do a reveal, but this gentleman's name's Brian, but he goes under another name. <laughs> Look at that. How cool is that? So, Brian has repainted this. He's added the cloth bandana. You got the trench coat. You look legit and power to you, man, for putting up with the hate. <laughs> Uh, she was like, how are you feeling? I said, I feel weird. I never feel sick and I feel really sick. And she's like, I've never seen you sick. This is kind of scary and stuff. I said, maybe we should call off the second show tonight. She goes, we already did. All right, geeks. It's day three for us for San Diego Comic Con, but unfortunately it's the last day of San Diego Comic Con altogether. So today is Casey Jones, as you can see right here. So. I think it's about 8.30 a.m. So we're gonna head in just after nine o'clock. Look how big the seagulls are. American seagulls are huge. Like, they're massive. Actually, oh look, look, it's a little baby. It's a little baby seagull. Um, so yeah, today it is 10 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. I wanna get a lot more footage down on the floor, as you guys saw before I got Pretty substantial amount of footage with the Shazam suit, um, all the sideshow collectible stuff, but I just really want to take in everything. I actually uh, did have a Wanda yesterday. I didn't take uh, the 80D, which is what I want to use on the floor. They have the prop store of London there, and there was the Edward Scissorhand costume there with the Scissorhand props. So I want to get some nice close-ups. The Scissorhand props, they also had uh, Robert Anglin's glove from Freddy vs. Jason there. It's expected to go for about 24,000 US dollars. It is crazy money for some copper, stainless steel, and leather. But I get it. So yeah, we're just about to catch the shuttle in. Last day of San Diego Comic Con. Let's make it a cracker. So of course today is 10 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. And this morning so far has been amazing. Just been chatting with some really cool people, some really cool fans. Just talking shop, talking about America. Um, it's been 
it's seriously been some of the best three days of my life. Like this is just absolutely phenomenal. The crowd seriously does make uh, the whole experience. When we finish up at 1.30, Gonna get the uh, the ADD and get some nice uh, shots, whether it be photo or video, down on the floor, and then we're gonna head back to LA. We, we're not staying tonight, you know. We're heading back to LA, so it's gonna be sad, but I'll be back. I'll be back. What are we gonna do tonight, right? Same thing we do every night, Chris. Try to take over Comic Con and then the world. <laughs> So I'm here with Jack. Jack, who are you dressed as? I'm dressed as Mega Man X. Today. Mega Man X, and Jack has made this himself. So is this EVA foam? It's all EVA foam, yeah. Absolutely incredible, dude. Look at the movement on that glove. How old are you? I'm 16. You're 16, dude. I couldn't do this stuff when I was 16. This guy's gonna be making the costumes for all the films. Okay, so it's after 1.30. We are done and dusted. So now I'm gonna head down to the floor try and get as much footage as I can, especially from the prop store of London. And I'm sad to say this, we're gonna call it a day. So guys, that is a wrap for San Diego Comic-Con 2018. I just want to give a massive thank you to Jen and Michael for being by my side, just being completely and utterly awesome throughout the whole weekend. It's been an amazing experience to say the least, and it's definitely not going to be the last time I will be here. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this vlog wherever you are in the world. I hope you have yourselves a cracker of a day. Hope you're well, hope you're happy, be merry, be silly, and until next time, geeks, please always remember, cosplayers do it best. That's a wrap. That's a wrap.